some more until dawn. It's about to get hot. Let's go. I like how I can move the camera around. Oh, wait a minute. Hey, the baby. Lips. Photo booth. All right, read my mind. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> This is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. Those two. Man. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you going to do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Not a lot of TLC for this place anymore. Kind of a bummer. Man, this game so far is very interactive and all this other stuff going on. Still a little creepy. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. I don't they agree? I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. <laughs> huh. I guess this thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? This is just all types of creepy. Ooh, what's this? Is that a totem? Mike! Generator! Oh right, got it. Uh oh. Danger. One, Mikey. Woo, you are a wizard. What the heck? What the heck is that? Oh, heck no. Nah, fam, nah. I ain't going down like that. That should Pretty be a code of some you? sort. Yeah, totally. Now this is awesome. Oh yeah, I bring the hit. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so. What? Right now. Give me a second, guys. Okay, I had to check and see if I was still recording because something weird happened to my gang. From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well. They never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Well, whoever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Sure, growing up, I was taught to never speak ill of the dead. 
Even if the person was a douchebag, you don't speak ill of the dead. Ever. Okay. The heck was that? Um, did you hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Please tell me it's another prank. Dang. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! What the heck are they doing hey, in Jessica? here? Yep. Hey. Um, okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. I didn't think I felt. Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Did you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. Who the heck is that dude? This cart thing? Right. I imagined us grunting together. This is not what I pictured. <laughs> I'm too black for this. Uh uh. My spider senses would have been all types of tingling. Especially when someone's following me. This way to get the heck out. Whoa, this place is that? like historical. Holy bat cave. It's got to be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> no, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? That could have been the symbol for for Wendigo. <laughs> you alright? Uh, yeah. Close one. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's Time to go. Yeah, let's get the heck out of here. Jesus, this place is a real fixer rubber. Goodbye here. Getting too creepy. A little ray of hope. Oh, I just need a ray of that. What's that light flicking up there?
Here, can you move faster? Well, well. When Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'm take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech. Oh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Um, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. The heck was that? Sampling the old eggnog again, babe? It's just us up here. Uh, maybe. Hey, Jess? Mm hmm. Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> I'm gonna go hug a bear. Something wrong with that picture. Okay, the music is getting real intense. Oh, look, a deer! What's up, dude? Oh, jeez! Watch out, bird brain! It's just... Just answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah. Got a lot of love to give. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh, man. This feels like a movie. I love game movies. <sighs> Damn it, Josh. Could you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. Oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah. Boo! Okay. Okay. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? Ah! Yes! The heck? What in Jesus' name is going on? Over here. Mm, 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 mm. What was that? 
That'll be my ticket to leave. <laughs> That's excuse enough for me to move the heck out. Nope, gotta go. I would think it would be some daytime here. Two card. This game makes you want to look out for stuff, search stuff. way sure that somewhere in this crazy place we used to have a spirit board a what wow you have a spirit board <laughs> yeah yeah they're fun right those things are a joke man they would do shit no way bro i mean we used to do it all the time me and well hey josh no hot water's kind of major oversight don't you think yeah yeah you just gotta fire up the boiler it's in the basement all right you guys see if you can find the spirit board chris Let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? Yeah, I mess with no Ouija boards. Forget that. So I was like, hey, you want you want mess with a Ouija board? I'm like, God bless you, I'm good on that. That's when they pull up, pull out a Ouija board. We're no longer friends after that. I'm out. Hey, you notice how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together? Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. 
And I just wish Chris would go for it. He's so paralyzed, thinking she's gonna shoot him down. It's not gonna happen. Which thing? Well, neither, if he doesn't go for it, which, knowing Chris, he won't, unless someone's holding a gun to his head. <laughs> So far, this game is smooth. You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and, you know, that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all going to make it through this, together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Got no flashlight. Not that. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. playing baseball out and all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality. Right, Sam? Anyway. I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you, can you hold this? Hold that. Hold is what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? Okay, I wasn't supposed to move. Sam, please. That's the thing, I didn't move. Wow, why is she moving so much? Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Sounds kind of complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Oh. That's more like it. <laughs> All right. Five, girl. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Josh and you. <laughs> oh, 
boy, you were really freaked out. or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Oh, oh snap! What the hell? Time to run. Gotta go. Get them feet moving. Go, 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 go. No, I'm on. Why are these doors locked? To, to keep out strangers. Huh? Hey. Uh, what? Hey. What the hell? Ooh, you just got mucked. What? <laughs> That's a nice one. That was good. What? But why would you do that? <laughs> There's all this cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said. Nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not! Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh! What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Oi, 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 oi. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Nope, we're not friends after that. No, no, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Uh-oh. The heck is that? A jar full of blood or something? Understand your feelings toward people who fear the supernatural, ghosts, spirits, and other intangible forces beyond the veil. Do you share this fear? Yeah. Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game. Now, is it? Investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was more <coughs> loyalty or honesty? <coughs> <coughs> 
So you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? <laughs> so you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in great need? Mm -mm -mm. Huh? Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Oh, we out of time? Alright. Ooh. It was just a prank, Han. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin when I told you about it? Yeah. yeah. All right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And wow. all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> I'm deadly serious. <laughs> all right, guys. Let's, Let's see. try this. Yes, please. Okay. I'll cut it here. I'm going to see you guys in the next one.